हेलो लिसनर्स यू आर वाचिंग माय यूट्यूब चैनल फार्मेसी लेसन्स मेड इजी द टॉपिक फॉर टुडेज वीडियो इज द स्टोरी ऑफ इंडियन फार्माकोपिया द फर्स्ट ऑफिशियल फार्माकोपिया ऑफ इंडिया अपीयर्ड इन 1868 व्हिच वाज एडिट एडिटेड बाय एडवर्ड जॉन वॉरिंग इन द प्री इंडिपेंडेंस डेज ब्रिटिश फार्माकोपिया वॉज यूज इन इंडिया The colonial addendum of BP 1898 was published in 1900 appeared as Government of India edition 1901 In 1946 Government of India issued one list which is known as Indian Pharmacopeial List One committee under the chairmanship of Sir R N Chopra along with other nine members prepared the Indian Pharmacopeial Lists It was prepared by Department of Health Government of India New Delhi in 1946 In 1948 the two years later to this Government of India appointed an Indian Pharmacopeial Committee for preparing Pharmacopeia of India The tenure of this committee was 5 years the Indian Pharmacopeia Committee under the chairmanship of Dr B N Ghosh published the first edition of indian pharmacopoeia in the year 1955 the indian pharmacopoeia is written in english and the official titles of monographs were given in latin it covers 986 monographs the supplement to this edition was published in 1960 then uh, this is the table which procure all the editions which have been published till date it starts from the first edition in the year 1955 up to the seventh edition 2014 this is uh, 1868 edition of pharmacopoeia of india the second edition of Indian Pharmacopoeia was published in 1966 under the chairmanship of Dr B Mukherjee official titles of monographs were given in english the doses were expressed in metric system for tablets and injection usual strength have been given the formulation of drugs were given immediately after the monographs of the drug in this edition 274 monographs from Indian Pharmacopoeia 1955 and their supplements were deleted from this and 93 new monographs were added the supplement to this edition was published in the year 1975 in which 126 new monographs have been included and 250 monographs have been amended cholera vaccine has been deleted from this Next comes the third edition. Third edition of Indian Pharmacopoeia was published in 1985 with two volumes and nine appendices, in which 261 new monographs have been added. 450 monographs were deleted. Addendum one to Indian Pharmacopoeia was published in 1989 uh, were f- there were 46 new monographs added and 126 were amended addendum second was published in 1991 where 62 new no- new monographs added and 110 were amended the fourth edition of Indian Pharmacopoeia was published in 1996 It was under the chairmanship of Dr. Nityanand. It has been made effective from 1st December 1996. It covered 1149 monographs and 123 appendices. It includes 294 new monographs and 110 monographs have been deleted. Addendum 1 has been made effective from 31st December 2000 and were 42 new monographs have been added addendum second have been made effective from 30th june 2003 where 19 new monographs have been added the veterinary supplements to indian pharmacopoeia 1996 which contained 208 monographs and four appendices 
was the next one next comes the fifth edition of indian pharmacopoeia it was published in the year 2007 and an addendum to this edition was published in the year 2008 indian pharmacopoeia 2007 is presented in three volumes volume 1 contained journal notices and journal chapters volume 2 and 3 contains journal monographs on drug substances dosage forms and pharmaceutical aids moving on to the next one that is indian pharmacopoeia 2010 it was a sixth edition of indian pharmacopoeia and it was published by indian pharmacopoeial commission ipc gaziabad in accordance with a plan and it was completed through the untiring efforts of its member secretariat and laboratory over a period of about 2 years it superseded the 2007 edition but any monograph of the earlier edition that does not figure in this edition this edition ha- was effective from 1st of september 2010 the indian pharmacopoeia 2010 is presented in three volumes volume 1 contains the notices preface and the structure of ipc acknowledgement introduction and general chapters volume second contain the journal notices journal monographs on dosage forms and monograph on drug substances dosage forms and pharmaceutical aids and the alphabets that were covered in volume second are from a to m volume 3 contains the next alphabet that is from n to z on the drug substances dosage forms and pharmaceutical aids it was followed by monographs on vaccines and immunosera for human use herbs and herbal products blood and blood related products biotechnology products and veterinary products the scope of pharmacopoeia has been extended to include the products of biotechnology indigenous herbs and herbal products veterinary vaccines additional anti retroviral drugs and formulations inclusive of commonly used fixed dose combinations the standards for new drugs and drugs used under national health program are added and the drugs as well as their formulation not in use now a day are omitted from this edition the number of monographs of excipients anti cancer drugs herbal products and anti retroviral drugs has been increased in the edition of indian pharmacopoeia 2010 the monographs of vaccines and immunosera are also upgraded in the view of development of latest technology in this field a new chapter on liposomal products and a monograph of liposomal amphotericin b injection is added advantage in the view of latest technology adopted for drug delivery moreover a chapter on nmr is incorporated in the appendices section the chapter on microbial contamination is also updated to a greater extent to harmonize with prevailing international requirements next is the seventh edition of indian pharmacopoeia it is published in year 2014 by indian pharmacopoeial commission on behalf of government of india ministry of health and family welfare it is presented in four volumes not in three in four volumes the scope of this pharmacopoeia has been extended to include additional anti cancer drugs anti retroviral drugs and the formulations products of biotechnology indigenous herbs and herbal products veterinary vaccines the indian pharmacopoeia 2014 incorporated 2550 monographs of drugs out of which 577 are the new monographs consisting of api that is active pharmaceutical ingredients excipients dosage forms and herbal products now what is the aim of preparing these pharmacopoeias uh, in short the aim of indian pharmacopoeial commission it is to provide uh, quality medicines through harmonized drug standards and monitoring the quality of medicines through effective regulatory system thank you everyone hope you like this video please click on the like button at the bottom of this video 
do subscribe to my channel and share it on social media thank you very much